Hello, my fellow Kansans. It's your buddy Joe here from the state of Kansas. Today we're doing something a little bit different. We're going to go down to a place called Jack Stacks Barbecue. Everyone at work and a lot of you know friends and neighbors have told me that this place is amazing. That if you love good barbecue, this is the one to go to. Now, I grew up where a barbecue was kind of like religion to a lot of people. I grew up in Houston, Texas. And, you know, in Houston, Texas, and in Texas in general, we have lots of multi-generational barbecue places. New Braunfels Smokehouse, Papa's Barbecue, Luther's. There's all sorts of barbecue places that are just absolutely amazing. So, come on a little ride with me and the fam. Let's go see uh, if uh, KC Barbecue compares. Really been looking forward to this all week. Thanks for coming along, guys. Oops, ran out of gas. Okay, we have made it. Let's see what we got going on here. I am super excited. Plate number one. Oh my god, it looks fat from this angle. We are going to tuck in. Good choice already. Okay, so sausage, here we go. Oh my god. The sausage is, oh my god. If y'all don't want the sausage, I'll eat it. Okay. You eat my portion. No, 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 no. Eat. It's really well done. You can tell it's very, very well crafted, good sausage. Now we're gonna check out Team Burnt Ends. Got some sauce on there. Got a little... The smell is divine. So let's see what we got going on here. Oh yeah. We ordered an extra side of our brisket and uh, wow. It took a little bit extra time to come out because the waiter explained that they weren't happy with the way the first cut looked, and uh, they I sincerely appreciate the effort behind that. Good deal. All right, we're going to talk ribs now, and uh, wow, we're talking soft, falls right off the bone, teeth chewing, probably not necessary, perfectly done. Aged to perfection, cut perfectly. Um, wow, I would come down here just for these. Damn freaking testing. 
All right, guys, we're going to go on to Team Brisket here, okay? I don't know about you, but I love a good brisket. Coming from Texas, brisket is huge. So uh, let's give it a shot. It's really good. Melts in your mouth. It's like butter. Highly recommend if you're coming here, come for the brisket. Wow. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I like this point out. See the smoke ring on it? That is what you know a quality brisket. Amazing stuff. So we're about to finish up the meats with this amazing looking chicken wing. I'm gonna give it a dab of sauce. A good chicken wing should come off the bone with not really much effort. The smell, obviously you can't get that on a video, but the smell is divine. The coloring, everything on there is exactly what I want. Got my little dab of the original sauce, which is pretty heavy barbecue sauce. So let's give this a shot. You know, if the YouTube algorithm wouldn't push me down if I dropped a series of F-bombs, I would do that. These are effing amazing. Wow. I would come down here literally just for a six piece of these and fries. That's good stuff. Now, no true barbecue experience is a true experience without side dishes. Now, where I screwed up is uh, I hit the meat kind of hard before I even tried the sides. So I had to wait a second for my tummy to settle. I've got a little fair sampling. I've got the potato salad, the baked beans, and the cream corn. And uh, we're gonna give them a shot here. So let's try, we're gonna start with the potato salad. I would bathe in that if I could. That that is that is a that is amazing. Now, every barbecue place needs to have some baked beans. Okay, you can, baked beans and barbecue that's just hand in hand. Okay, so let's see what we got going on here. Mm. It's got a little bit of pork in there. It's got just the right amount of sauce to where it's not overpowering. Wow, I haven't had anything I didn't like yet. That, and I normally can find something to gripe about. And next, we're gonna do the uh, cream corn, which uh, another one of those things just goes well, perfectly well with any barbecue. So let's tuck in. Cream corn. It's a cheesy corn bake. Oh, cheesy corn bake. I'm sorry, it looks like cream corn. It has but, cheese um, and like bits of I was about to say, that's some, some sausage and ham in it and cheese. Wow. So I've discovered a new dish I didn't even know existed and I love. Uh, so far, so good. The conclusion coming up in a little bit. Thanks for staying with me, guys. Just when I think I'm out, they pull me back in. You know, I thought I was done and then they mentioned the dessert. So uh, there's going to be a few more things to try. So like I mentioned earlier, I got pulled in to dessert. First, I'm gonna try the chocolate brownie if with a scoop there. of ice cream on it. If it's still there by the time I'm done with my monologue, I get some, um, let's see here. Get, get, get a glimpse of it on the camera there. Uh, camera doesn't quite do it justice. It looks amazing. Oh, God. Oh, my God. You know what this tastes like? This tastes like I'll never be skinny. Okay, and the last thing on the dessert menu that I'm trying today is the... It's carrot, carrot cake. cake. Carrot cake. It's got... Some says that I like a pistachio. Cream cheese. It's cream cheese glaze with long pistachios in it or walnuts. Okay. Let us try. Oh. I'm not honestly the biggest carrot cake person in the world, and I would eat that any day. Any day. Wow. Okay, so wrap up coming shortly. In conclusion, absolutely positively worth the drive, worth the money. The portion size, I said it in the video, I'll say it again, was incredible. The uh, platter we ordered could have easily served six. 
and looking at the prices, if I was in KC or KC metro area and wanted a uh, reasonable lunch, great. The wait staff, absolutely fantastic. Really fun banter back and forth. All in all, great experience. I would give it a 9.8 off of off of 10 because let's face it, nothing in this world is perfect. But that's the highest rating I have ever given. Am I partial to barbecue? Being a native Texan, of course I am. But they, these guys do everything right. Highly recommend Jack Sacks Barbecue, Kansas City. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed my review, please feel free to hit like. Thanks so much.